Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert from UnkertEducation.com here. In this video, we're going to install Discord on a Chromebook. The first thing we want to do is enable the Linux development environment. So to do that, I'm going to click on my launcher here, and I'm going to find my settings, either by searching or finding the icon. And on the left-hand side of the settings, near the bottom, you'll see Advanced. I'm going to click on that to expand that tab, and scroll on down to where I see Developers. Here I'll click on Developers, and where it says Linux Development Environment, I'm going to click Turn On. That's going to start up a setup wizard for the Linux development environment. I'm going to click Next, and it's going to give me a username based off of my email, and then a recommended disk size. I'm going to change this because my Chromebook does have some more storage, so I'm going to up this. You can keep it as is if you want. Depends on how many apps you want to install, install and the size of your Chromebook. And once I change it, I'm going to click install. And that's going to take a few moments to run ahead and install Linux. So I'll come on back once that's done. Okay, once that goes ahead and installs, a terminal will pop up. I'm going to expand this and increase the size here so you can see it a little bit better what I'm doing. And I'm going to make sure everything is up to date by typing sudo apt get update and then two ampersands and then sudo apt get dist dash upgrade. And I'm going to use a dash y flag so I don't have to answer yes to the additional space. And I'll hit enter and let that run. Once the Linux development environment is enabled, we can go ahead and install Discord. To do that, let's open up a browser window and let's search for Discord here. And we want to go to download. So it's saying download for Windows. What I'm going to do is scroll down here and we're going to find download for Linux. I want to download the .dev file, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay. Now I'm going to click Show in Folder, and I should note this works for Intel or AMD-based Chromebooks. I don't have an ARM-based Chromebook, so I can't speak to that. But if you have an Intel or AMD-based Chromebook, what we'll do now is we'll right-click and click Install with Linux. We'll then click Install and OK. OK, now that the installation is complete, we can click here to Launch, or we can go to our Launcher here and we can find the Discord icon. I'm going to pin this to my shelf and then click to launch. Okay, after downloading and installing some updates, Discord can start up. You can enter your email and your password and log in and begin using Discord on your Chromebook. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.